Well guys, welcome back to the channel again today. Today we got Gavin's car in. There's Gavin there. Hey. hey. Right, today we are doing four tyres. Uh, we've got rear pads and discs uh, to go on. Um, what's in that one again, Gav? Uh, oh, it's the brake fluid. Yeah, sorry, so that's brake fluid. We've got the braided lines there. So right, guys, we're just gonna crack on. We're gonna get the wheels off, uh, start putting the tyres on, and then jump onto the brakes. Uh, run into a little bit of a problem. Uh, braided lines ain't gonna happen today. I'll just show you why. That nut there, the typical nut is seized. I haven't got any pipe as well to renew it. So once I've got the bit of pipe come through, we're gonna be putting uh, the new braided lines on. Same time, a lot of you all know about these. As you can see there, guys, that's on its way out. It needs a new bolt. Uh, so we're going to get some of those ordered up and uh, redo that. With the rear, this is the only pipe that managed to uh, undo okay. So we're not going to do the rears. The other side's seized as well. So it's uh, braided lines ain't going to happen. So we're just going to basically stick to doing the rear pads, rear disc and the tyres. Uh, just show you Gavin's tyre. <laughs> he probably won't want to see it, but yeah, as you can see, guys, looks like a slick. So uh, there was another thing. You probably can't see it too well, but the actual uh, thread coming through, as you can see there. So yeah, in desperate need of new tyres. So we're gonna get those tires off and get the new ones on from over there. probably seen me doing the wheel the opposite way around to what it should be like the top being up here and that the reason why I've done that uh, these are backwards fit wheels because of the lip here is so high you can't get the tire over so the easiest way is to flip it on its front and do it in reverse from the back um, so when you're doing these tires obviously on here, you've got outside, you probably won't see it, but you've got outside written on there. So just remember, if you're ever doing these tires yourself, flip them over so the outside goes down to the outside, because obviously the tire's in reverse. That's all the tyres all done, to show you. Nice fresh rubber on the tyres. Now we're gonna move on to the rear brake, start stripping them down and get the new pads and discs on.
just a little thing I've seen uh, with a lot of people um, that come into me sometimes and that. If you see inside your brake reservoir that it's low, do not top it up with brake fluid. Just leave it as it is. That is an indication that your brakes are low. Um, obviously, it can get low if you've got a leak, but then you'll know you've got a leak because you'll end up with no brakes. But if you've still got brakes and it's all okay, and you see this low, don't top it up because what happens is when your brakes go low, this goes down. And when you push the brake pads back, the fluid comes back up to the top. So as you can see in this, the fluid's down. I've seen a lot of people, they, they seem to think that their brake fluid's low and they top it up. And by the time when you go to do the brakes, it all comes out and it just makes a mess. So it will just give you an indication, guys, that there's the new pads all in, all the new shims in there. And where's the old pads here? Yeah. As you can see, with the new ones, there's not much life left on them. Uh, so that would be the reason why your fluid goes down in the car. So you ever see it, don't top it up, leave it. It's just an indication uh, that your brakes are getting low, basically. So yeah, just be mind sharp of that, guys. Right guys, that's it for today. Everything's all done. Happy man. Happy man. <laughs> yeah. Hey. Right, let's go have a look at this. Right. After it's all been cleaned up. So AJ, if you're out there and you're watching this, bruv, you're not the only one with a red clean engine bay. <laughs> no, he's joking, man. No. But yeah, look at this, guys. Everything's all cleaned up and that underneath. Everything all nice and clean. Yeah. And we've got all the um, tyres on now as well. Nice fresh. And the rear pads and this. All looking nice and fresh. So, right guys. So that's it for today. Hope you all enjoyed. Um, hope you got a little bit of um, an idea with the brake set up and the fluids and all that lot. Um, yeah, so hope you all enjoyed it. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to hit like and subscribe uh, button and catch you on the next one. Cheers, guys.